grilled lamb chops with lemon and cardamom is a very simple recipe to make. The lemon and cardamom add an oriental touch that will delight the amateurs of lamb. To make that recipe, you will need cardamom powder, olive oil, chopped garlic, lemon, salt, freshly ground peppercorns, and a rack of lamb or lamb chops. First of all, let's make the rub. Zest the lemon that I have pre-washed earlier. So you don't want to grate the white part of the citrus because that will be bitter. All the oils and flavors are in the zest. Good. Then add the cardamom powder the chopped garlic and the olive oil with a fork mix the ingredients together add a pinch of salt and freshly ground peppercorns Great. Then reserve the rub and let's prepare our chops. Clean your rack of lamb if your butcher didn't do it well. So here we have along the line, we have some connected tissue or silver skin. We must remove it because it will be tough. With a deboning knife, cut through the fat and just remove it. So I'll go over, hold it and follow. Now, the, into the loin, there is a, the fat goes inside the meat and leave that part, uh, this is fat with a thin connective tissue, leave it on because if you separate it, then you will lose a little piece of meat, which is a, like a small tender loin along the loin. Then turn the rack over and with a chef knife, separate the chops. Then you can remove one here, just the bone, and cut that one in half as you have nice thick chops. Add the chops to the marinade. And rub the meat over the marinade on both sides. That way the meat will absorb all the flavors. Cover the lamp with plastic wrap. So you want to use food wrap, obviously. And reserve your lamb chops refrigerated for at least an hour. Prepare the other lemon that we are going to use as a stand or a piece to hold our chops. I'll show you. Cut the base of the lemon to make it flat. Then you're going to make some cut inside the lemon because this is where we're going to pick the chops around the lemon. An hour has passed, then preheat your grill and let's finish our lamb chops. So let's remove the plastic. We put, we season them earlier with a pinch of salt, but it's not enough. We have to put a little bit more. So season them over with salt. Turn them, yeah, turn them. Good. 
and season the other side. Great. Let's go to the stove. Place the chops on the hot grill, all the same way. Grill the chop for one minute and a half to two minutes, then we will move them to cross mark them. After a minute and a half, give them a turn by 90 degrees on the same side. And with a brush, brush a little bit of the marinade over the chops. The smell is wonderful, it's amazing. It's been three minutes, now let's do the same thing for the other side. Let's give them a last turn. So we turn them every minute and a half or every two minutes if you want them medium and a minute and a half if you like them medium rare. Done. Turn off the grill, remove the chops from the grill. Mm, they're going to be medium rare. I can see one medium. This one's going to be medium because the blood's pearling on the top. You see, it's floating on the top. And the other one, you don't see the blood. So those will be medium rare. And this one was thinner, so it, it's a little bit more cooked. So it, it will be medium. Allow the chops to rest for three to five minutes. They will continue to cook and the rare chops will become medium rare. Then pick the bone on the lemon. There you go. So here, I have decided to present my lamb chops on a less classical way, more for a cocktail style. But if you are going to have it as a main course, you may serve it on a plate, on a more regular fashion. I hope you will enjoy this recipe, and I'm sure you will, because it's wonderful. The lemon and cardamom spices on the lamb chops are truly amazing. Bon appétit!